G'day guys, today we're going to be doing an unboxing of this brand new Akubra hat. And no, it's not going to be this thing. Oh god no, it's not going to be that thing. This is the Akubra website. Uh, for anyone who doesn't know, they are an, they are an Australian brand. Uh, probably one of, if not the most recognised hat makers around. You may or may not have heard the company name in the past. They've been around for many, many years, uh, but you've probably seen their products, mainly hats, on people's heads in movies. So, I thought to myself, uh, why not get myself one of them, especially since my hat from six, seven years ago, uh, God, it's really seen better days. Take a quick look at this. This is a, this is a, a quick five second clip from uh, my one of my travel vlogs from six seven years ago uh watch this so that's my hat there looking really really plump and amazing in the london underground with my mom uh yeah i mean it's obviously seen better days you know i am actually going to be making a travel vlog soon on holiday with my mom very very soon which is why i actually wanted another hat uh, this really needs to go bye-bye. I could have said it another way, but it needs to go in the goddamn trash, probably. I'll probably keep it for sentimental reasons. But anyway, uh, right now we have this box. And I'm, I'm guessing this is a Kubra. I have absolutely no idea, but I'm thinking that this is actually the Akubra uh, box. I think we will zoom out a little and we'll change the camera angle for that so we can actually see what's going on. Hey, hey, done. I want to, I better reduce the amount of uh, blade that comes out. I don't want to hit the hat by accident. If it is the hat, I'm pretty sure it is. Now I'm going to show you a, a top three or top four list of, of hats that I was actually thinking about getting. Uh, I ended, oh, wow, look at that. That's awesome. This is literally my first time seeing it. That is so cool. Before I have a look at that, uh, have a quick look at this. Going to the hat section, uh, changing the camera angle there. So Avalon was gonna be a potential for me. I kind of like the design of that and the color as well. Uh, going down, the Cattleman is, ended, is pretty much what I ended up getting. Awesome looking hat. Uh, of course, they come in different colors, and uh, yeah, the prices, god damn, the prices are a little high, aren't they? But that's what you're getting, I guess. You're getting quality. Uh, Leisure Time is another one that I thought was kind of cool. Of course, once again, you can get different uh, colors. Going to page two. Where is the other one? I think it was this one. I was, I was also tossing up between this one. Yeah, Tablelands. Not too bad, but of course going, oh, there's Crocodile Dundee, the croc. That's a Crocodile Dundee looking, uh, looking hat. Gosh, it really is, eh? That's actually Crocodile Dundee. I don't know if I noticed that before. So yeah, going back to this one again, which is of course the Cattleman. I thought this, this one looked awesome. It looked amazing. In my own opinion, of course, uh, they give you this, piece, this picture here on how to actually measure your head. I did the whole measuring situation, and this is what came. Let's have a look. This is going to be the invoice. I'll put that over here for now. Wow. There's a there's a something inside. I'll show you that in a second. But wow, look at that. That is awesome. I'll actually get these out very very quickly. A sticker, I think. Think. So this thing right here, now I'll just quickly show you the website. Uh, whew, let's have a quick look. Going to accessories. And uh, this, uh, you can you know, get some accessories with the order, but I think this, this particular accessory was really practical. Bit of a chin strap situation. Uh, so your hat doesn't fall off your head when it's windy. So I ended up get, uh, deciding to get the uh, the brown color, this one. 
as opposed to the black. I thought the black looked a little too cheap in my on my yeah you know, on my in my in my opinion. So yeah, I have that as well. Going back to that camera angle. And for anyone interested, yeah, we are making videos weekly in the studio, live, pretty much unedited. Uh, if that sounds exciting, come give us a like and a subscribe if you haven't already. <sighs> Shameless plug. Shameless plug, but that's what that is going to be looking like. The chin strap. I don't know if we'll be putting that on the hat today as we are filming this live and we're trying to get this done as efficiently as possible. Let's, uh, let's take this out. I might make the brightness just a little brighter actually, 100%. There we go. How do you take this out without damaging it? It just feels like it doesn't want to come out. There we go. Smell test. Not really much of a smell, to be honest. There is some leathery smell, but it's not, it's not really overpowering. No. Anyway, uh, let's put it on my head. I mean, it's really where it needs to be, right? Now, look, before I put this on my head, my inspirations uh, for getting this particular hat, bit of an Indiana Jones fan. I have seen Crocodile Dundee in the past, not for like 10 years now, probably. <laughs> uh, there was also that movie Australia with, with Hugh Jackman. He wore a hat that was similar. But I think this hat has all the qualities of rugged Australian, while also being practical, obviously keeping the sun off your head. I mean, you know, I'm pretty sunburned after being outside for five minutes, so, you know, Christ compels you, son, holy water, probably all over me, because, you know, I'm sunburned terribly, so it's, it's a very practical and very stylish looking hat, I've wanted one for a while, uh, finally built, built the bullet, I guess you could say, what else, what else is actually in here, before I put the, before I actually try it, nothing, not really, some possibly some more stickers in there, I'm not really sure. Let's try the hat test. First time. Wow. How does that look? It's not too bad actually. Wow. That feels really good. I actually really like that. That's that's so cool. I really need a mirror. I can see myself on the monitor in front of me, but uh, I really need a mirror to really feel the vibe. Look, what do you guys actually reckon about that? I'm telling you now, this actually fits a thousand times better than this hat ever did. This hat was always a little too small for my head. Um, and now it's completely unwearable. I mean, it's just shrunk beyond what it could yeah but you know i don't know how, how i can say it but it's just completely shrunk uh too much beyond anything that i can ever imagine i guess it's just uh i don't know i think i had it on top of the cabinet in my house for a number of years and i think things just started to go on top of it as you put things on top of the cabinet and i think it's just kind of squashed it but um there you go what do you guys reckon about that yeah, you know, now look, I do actually have my hair out only maybe 30% of the time. The rest is definitely in. I have the hair in the majority. So this is usually what I have going on. I've got the man bun. <sighs> Make as many jokes as you want. I've already goddamn heard them. All right. <laughs> is this going to work with a man bun? I have absolutely no idea, but we're going to give them a go. Look at the pitch inside, by the way. I'm gonna zoom in just a little. It's so cool. What does that say? So I've got number 62. That's the size of my head, apparently, after doing the measurements. A Cobra. Very, 
very nice. Let's go back to this. Gosh, it actually fits. Wow. That's actually going to be really, really good because I am going to be making a few different travel vlogs when I go on this holiday very, very soon uh, for my first YouTube channel. That's number two, of course. You're watching that on number two right now. But of course, number one is my first channel where I do travel vlogs. So I will be making that on the, on that channel, on those travel vlogs on, the, on that channel. But yeah, what do you guys think? Let me know down in the comments below. Am I giving you Indiana Jones vibes? Probably not. Indiana Jones's uh, dorky cousin. Uh, probably that's the vibes I'm giving you, but there you go. What do you guys reckon? That's the back. Chin straps. Uh, I've been told my name's Gareth. I'll see you for the next video. I hope you guys like the unboxing. We usually make travel vlogs and of course unboxing videos about technology, technology reviews as well. Uh, if that sounds fun. I'll see you for the next one. Ciao.